Hi, my name is Jack. We're at the former Straight Ahead Ministries Academy in Hubbardston, Mass. It was a residential program of which I was the vocational director. And I'm here with a uh, former student of mine. This is Chris. Hi, my name is Chris. I've been here for, well, when, when this program was up and running, I was here for about six months. And uh, in this shop, I was the shop foreman. And I uh, cleaned it up, you know, it gave me a lot of responsibilities and learning experiences. The biggest impact that I had here was probably the reliable staff because you could always count on them, go to them whenever you needed to talk to somebody. They were trusting, like it would just basically be if you need to talk to someone, go to them and they'd help you out. We're now going to visit a former student of mine from the Rhode Island Training School and also Straight Ahead Academy. He's an employee at Walmart and doing very well for himself. His name is Josh Mendes. All right, I'm Josh. I'm 20 years old, and I first met Jack at the Rhode Island Training School. I was doing my sentence there, and I, he ended up teaching. I had already gotten my GED, so I was in a set post-secondary class. I was a shy kid, you know, I didn't want to talk about nothing, and I had opened up a little bit to him personally, but not to anybody else. It ended up being that, you know, straight ahead, had a big production with my unit, and I ended up, by the end of the weekend, I had shared with my whole unit a dream and a vision of swim, swim coach, being a swim coach in front of my whole unit, which is a little embarrassing in the training school, you can't say stuff like that, but I did. And then it just went from there, straight ahead, accepted me to go into their program. I went into their program, did everything I could to work myself, you know, up and out of there. They got me my job here at Walmart, starting off as a car pusher. And now I'm as high as I can go. I run the automotive department. I'm as high as I can go hourly. No, the only next step up is salary. So. And you have two children. And I have two children. As you can see, kids like Chris and Josh are products of a negative environment. Place them into a positive environment, a nice wilderness setting, nurturing, love, understanding and compassion, and guidance and work ethics. They can really turn the corner and they can be productive uh, members of society. If you need to talk to someone, go to them.